Pentagon orders entire F-35 fleet grounded. He Pentagon has ordered its entire fleet of F-35 fighters to be grounded in the wake of a Marine F-35B crash in South Carolina last month. All variants of the jet, including the Air Force version and Navy C version, are included, according to Lee Hudson of Aviation Week. Flight operations for the strike fighter have been temporarily suspended as the military conducts a fleet-wide inspection of a fuel tube within the engines of all F-35 aircraft, a Pentagon spokesman told Task and Purpose. If suspect fuel tubes are installed, the part will be removed and replaced, Joe Delavadova, a spokesman with the Pentagon's Joint Program Office, which oversees the F-35, said in a statement. If known good fuel tubes are already installed, then those aircraft will be returned to flight status, Delavadova said. Inspections are expected to be completed within the next 24 to 48 hours. The decision to inspect the aircraft fuel tube stemmed from an ongoing investigation into the F-35B crash that occurred shortly after a takeoff from the Marine Corps Air Station in Beaufort, South Carolina on September 28. The primary goal following any mishap is the prevention of future incidents, Delavadova said. We will take every measure to ensure safe operations while we deliver, sustain, and modernize the F-35 for the warfighter and our defense partners. Here's the full statement from JPO. The US services and international partners have temporarily suspended F-35 flight operations while the Enterprise conducts a fleet-wide inspection of a fuel tube within the engine on all F-35 aircraft. If suspect fuel tubes are installed, the part will be removed and replaced. If known good fuel tubes are already installed, then those aircraft will be returned to flight status. Inspections are expected to be completed within the next 24 to 48 hours. The action to perform the inspection is driven from initial data from the ongoing investigation of the F-35B that crashed in the vicinity of Beaufort, South Carolina on September 28. The Aircraft Mishap Board is continuing its work and the U.S. Marine Corps will provide additional information when it becomes available. The primary goal following any mishap is the prevention of future incidents. We will take every measure to ensure safe operations while we deliver, sustain, and modernize the F-35 for the warfighter and our defense partners.